Good greetings and welcome, fellow commanders, to another episode of Let's Play Nexus to Jupiter Incident. All right, let's see if we can Unknown do this properly. Detected. We're picking up some Warning. unidentified ships, Enemy sir. Ship identified. Affirmative. Aye, aye, sir. Warning. Enemy ship identified. Right. Warning. Enemy ship identified. Still the same goal. Warning. Let's get our Enemy shields going and max weapons. Sir, we are under, we attack. Are under attack. Commander Warning. Ironside, who Enemy are they? By the look of their fighters, they're raptors. They are the gene-manipulated, cybernetically enhanced and controlled killers of the Vardrags. You don't want to mess with them. But I thought the Vardrags were our allies. So did I. I've heard rumors about rogue raptors turning to piracy, but they couldn't possibly be in our system. Maybe this isn't the best time to talk politics. We have to hold out until the mammoths can jump. Red alert! The unidentified ships are attacking. I repeat, the convoy is under attack. Commander Ironside, they're firing on us. Yep. We're under attack. This is the mammoths. We need help. Amid Task complete. Yes, sir. All right. Where is the crew Idiot, shooting please at? Please respond. We need help immediately. They just keep on shooting. A hull will get in. Poison is dead. You're going after the fist. Aye, aye, sir. Aye, aye, sir. If we can keep the chrome operational, that should be fine. Enemy squadron destroyed. Good. This is the fat lady. We're taking a pounding. Help us out. Shoot you and then Understood. redirect my energy cannons to that. What's going on? Can anybody hear me? We can't take much more of this. Right, there goes the fist. Aye, aye, sir. Now, with both the chrome and me pounding misery, we should be able to hold this. It is technically possible to save all the ships, I think, but most likely you will always lose the manatus because there's just so little you can do to kill efficiently, especially if the chrome gets stupid. Right. Aye, aye, sir. Sir, the attackers have destroyed the Manatus. Its crew are evacuating. Hey! These guys are nailing our flags! Do something about it! Help! What the hell is going on? Enemy squadron destroyed. Alright, come on. Get those shields down. Enemy task complete. Affirmative. Kill it. Misery is down, good. 
That should trigger the other ships to now come and engage us. Or at least me. Yes, sir. Let's move towards them. Five minutes until the cargo carriers can jump, sir. Warning. We are under attack. Understood. Affirmative. Affirmative. Now our shield should be able to take these because the uh, these destroyers and or the hunters are not that strong. And as long as the chrome doesn't go stupid, we should be able to hold this. ship is powered down so it doesn't show up. Right, we've almost got the shields down on the crew, although the chrome has gone stupid and started targeting someone else because of course they have. Enemy task complete. And I power it into submission and Understood. shields lat. Is dead. Now uh, we're moving towards the fight. And it looks like the chrome is still attacking it, so that should make this a little bit easier and faster. Two minutes until the cargo carriers can jump, sir. Mm, not a lot of time. Just kind of why you want to sync up with the chrome in the first place, because otherwise this takes just a little bit too long. Enemy task complete. Aye, aye, sir. And. Aye, aye, sir. How are you going with that? Right, the fright is down. And then there's just the Annihilator left, but I don't think we can uh, kill it quickly enough. Affirmative. Understood.
as the Annihilator is quite some distance away. And even at full burn, that takes a while to get to. Yep, yeah, not gonna get it. Attention, cargo fleet! I'm activating the synchronized jump now! is missing. It was captured by the attackers. Alright, come on, jump away. actions gave the needed time for the slow freighters to escape. Although we were unable to rescue all of them, without your help, the raid would have been far more severe. If our information is correct, the attackers were raptors, elite soldiers the Vardrags. This should not be possible since their cybernetic implants should result in unconditional loyalty. Presumably, a group of them was separated from the Vardrags when the wormhole system collapsed and their offspring do not have the implants that ensure loyalty. They have the battle intelligence, power, and speed of the raptors, but none of the scruples. Yeah. I mean, we did kill a lot of enemies, but unfortunately, because my only ally was not competent enough, we didn't get all of it. A pity. Like I said, it is technically possible to save them all, I think. But that requires to be so on top of your game, I don't think I can do it anymore. Plus it's annoying to have to do that over and over again. Right, Cartago base. Rear Admiral Arthur Norbank here, Captain. You'll have heard of me, I'm sure. As commander of the defensive fleet of the NOAA system, I am, of course, your superior. Uh -huh. Don't feel too ashamed that you fled from the Raptors. It's hardly surprising that someone with your limited experience couldn't deal with them. The Raptor pirates managed to capture one of our cargo carriers. They appear to be heading toward a hitherto unknown wormhole. The same one they used for their incursion into our system. Based on projections extrapolated from their current vector, the wormhole is located at this planetoid. You've given them a significant head start, but the cargo carrier is slowing them down. Only our destroyers are capable of intercepting them before they enter the wormhole. They must be captured. We cannot let them turn our crew into their slaves. Your objective is simple. Escort the destroyers and carry out Praetorian Raptors to the target area. Under normal circumstances, I wouldn't assign you to deploy the Praetorians, but unfortunately I have no choice. Only your ship is large and fast enough. <laughs> the Rome will follow you. All you have to do is to contain them for a while. We'll take over from there when we arrive. You know, Rear Admiral, I get the distinct feeling you're blaming me for the events of that particular excursion. I didn't flee. 
I just merely saw a more tactically advantage to not stick around with the Annihilator on my back. Well, at least the ship isn't damaged. Um, let's see, is there anything new in the lineup that they give us? Let's see, the combat fire cloud engine. Um, I think the combat fire cloud is probably bigger than our current system, so can I just install it? No, I just have to replace it then. I think that's a little bit more useful to us. Alright, so we got some Praetorian gunboats. It's fine. I think nothing else has changed. Anyway, aside from that, I just don't have the points. I don't have the space either. This is likely not going to be a mission where we can easily do whatever we need to. I mean, I'd love to be able to get another uh, electron cell. But I don't have the points for that. So I'll just confirm this then. And let's start the mission. Cromwell. The Raptor pirates have broken away from the cargo carrier. They are attempting to escape. The carrier is still heading towards the wormhole. We'll take care of the pirates. You disable the cargo carrier. Just blow up its engines. It shouldn't present a problem. Unknown. I know how to disable a craft. Or did you think Captain was a nickname? I beg your pardon, sir. I did not mean to sound patronizing. Please wait for us next to the cargo carrier. We'll be there in half an hour. Good luck. Sir, we have the wormhole on visual. Unfortunately, of course, I don't have any disabling weapons on me at the moment, but that's fine. We have the spark fighters. And it doesn't, its flag system is still disabled, so. Understood. Understood. Alright, we're going to have visuals. Assume crab formation. Copy that. Don't confuse your port with starboard this time, Steve. <coughs> Such friendly banter. Let's give it a little bit of extra burn so we can close quickly. Ships have engaged. Understood. Sir, we've detected Raptor ships. An ambush. No turning back now. We have to stop the carrier. Uh, yeah, 
Clearly, very intelligent conversation. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.